Hello everyone. I want to first off by saying I appreciate everybody's comments on my previous video. Um, there's a lot of things that some people want. I'm going to take into consideration uh, as I go forward with some of these videos. But anyway, we're going to jump into this review. This is going to be another supposedly like more natural laundry detergent that I wanted to test. This is a uh, safely everyday laundry. And I'm going to test it because I just want to see how good it does. Now, when it comes to recommending this, just off the back, it's so hard for me to recommend this product because it is so much more expensive. This small thing says it can do 40 loads, right? But we all know that's only if you do it, fill it to the small line. And supposedly it's supposed to be, you know, very concentrated, just like the Ecos one is supposed to be very concentrated. So you're not supposed to need a lot. But for this product to cost $13.88 after tax, it's so hard for me to recommend it if this thing is, does not do like the most amazing job because that's more than Thai, that's more than Persil, that's more than All, that's more than Arm & Hammer, like more than Gain for that small amount. Like I, it's, it's, it's too, it's not worth it for me. Anyway, the stains that we will be testing is hot sauce. This is mustard. This is a chili powder-ish sauce concoction that I made. And this is like one of those veggie type smoothie things that I had made and I just let it sit on there. All these have rested for 48 hours. So what we're gonna do is same as before, we're gonna let it choose the water level. We're gonna put it on cool. It's gonna be a normal cycle. There will be no second rinse and there will be no auto soap. Somebody wanted me to not like pre-treat, like pour some of the detergent, put it on the stain and let it rest for 15 minutes. So I'm not gonna do that this time. I'm just gonna let it do its own thing, but I am gonna fill it to the medium line and, and not the small. I'm not gonna do a large because this isn't a large low, you know, this is the eight shirt test. I always have eight shirts to throw in there. So I'm going to do that. Hold on. Okay, so now I have this filled to the medium line. So we're just gonna pour that in yeah some people i see them throw the cup in there i don't like doing that that's just me but we're gonna throw all the shirts in now okay we'll be back in a moment okay so one of my first videos that i did talked about how you know says don't mean nothing it says all day some of them put um certain agents in the um chemical agents in the detergent to make it says more because of consumers um wanting things to say more but it is still interesting to see that this is a really sudsy thing it does have a smell i'm not gonna say it's strong but it's mild it's not weak it's mild a scent so it's just one of them fresh clean smells so hmm We'll see what, how everything turns out in the end. So let's talk about it. This is a hard no. Do y'all see three out of the four stains are still there. This is much lighter, but it's very obvious that you can see. And I, you could pick it up even more on the camera. This this stain, the hot sauce stain. And then you could see like the oil-ish residue from the chili paste powder type thing is still there. This, the stain that was here is taken away, so that's good, but for $13 and what did I say, 88 cents? No, this is what I'm about to do. I'm gonna pre-treat this whole shirt with this, let it sit for 15 minutes, then I'm gonna wash it again, and then I'm gonna see if it makes a difference. If it doesn't make a difference, let me tell you something, this ain't worth it. I'm already telling you this is not worth it. I don't like this. I would not recommend nobody buy it. Even if you're looking for a a more eco-friendly natural detergent, there are other options. I would go with the Ecos one. The I'll put a little note to watch that video up so you can see that review. This is, for how much it costs, it's not worth it at all. Okay, so here we are. And the mustard stain is still there. It's lighter and it's hard to see, but it's maybe y'all can see a little bit of the ring, like right on this outer portion. It's still there, but it's a lot lighter. Um, and it's hard to see. I can't see if it's getting an angle. You can still see like some of the oil residue over here. Let me tell y'all something. Don't do this. It's not even worth it. Even, not at all. And I'm not gonna front with anybody about this. This, when I looked at it, I was like, this is so sad. 
I added a scoop of OxyClean to this. And that's really what did a lot of the work on this second go round. And it still looks this way. So this detergent is garbage. It was not worth the $13.88. The $1.25 um, LA's Totally Awesome Laundry Detergent would have done a comparable job. So it's, what are you saving the planet? But you know, how much how much are you saving the planet when you have to do multiple loads and use a, that's multiple wash cycles or using water, you're wasting energy. Like this isn't, this is a very poor product. Like, let me tell you something. This smells really good. That's the only thing this thing has going. It's a mild scent, like I said before, but it smells really, really nice. I really do like how it smells. And I'm not the person that's really, y'all know I'm not, I don't really care about fragrance in my laundry, but if you have clothes that just don't get stains like this, you're not a person whose clothes just get stains and not dirty and all that stuff. And you just wanted to pick this up because you either like the creator of the brand or you just felt in your spirit you wanted to try it. You can go for it. You know, results may vary, but this was my experience with this. This is a, a trash laundry detergent. It almost makes me want to just go back to Walmart and uh, return it because this is, this is, it's not, it's not even in focus. Will you focus? Thank you. Uh, it's, it's so bad. I don't even have, I have nothing good to say about this. Like I'd give this a whole F on the scale because it's just, for how much, it, the prices was blowing my mind. The price is what makes me really be like, no, nah, this isn't so good. I've had some detergent reviews that um, didn't do as well, but their price was just like, oh, it's whatever. This, no. Y'all have a great day.